after a very confusing venture, we have found ourselves at the Balachulish Hotel. We're in room 22. We have, oh, lots of storage. And a hair dryer. Hopefully this one works. Yeah. And an iron. It smells very neat. Oh, loud doors. We have a king bed. We have two tonic waters and gin. We have two chairs. We have just a giant water bottle. That's lovely. Nice coffee tea situation with Scottish shortbread. But this, come on. Does that not move? I don't care. This is why we booked it. With a lock view. Does it open? Did I just break the window? Oh, you have to push it. Pop it. Twist it. Okay. Oh, that's how the window opens. Outwards. That's nice. Oh, we're right by these pretty horrible flowers we walked by. All right, and let's take you to the bathroom. Be sure to take a picture of the stuff on the toilet paper. Stuff on the toilet, oh, the toilet paper flowers? Yeah. Very pretty. So this is Aaron Brand. We've got bath and shower gel. Shampoo, teeny tiny soap, and a really high step in on this shower. For context, it's all the way to my knee. It's okay. <sighs> all right, standard shaver plug. So, all right, here we are. Balachulish Hotel. All right, walking down the hallway of the Balachulish Hotel. We are in the West Wing, which leads right into the car park area. We got the best parking spot that we possibly could, so that's nice. Um, it's a little bit misty, but I don't mind. So it's a little confusing when you come in because it says hotel reception to go this way. But if you go this way, they're redoing the concrete and haven't put up a, hey, you should go somewhere else sign. So you have to walk down these down steps through the really pretty archway. And you get to where I pulled in first. I assume this is the overflow parking lot. So I'm going to level with you right now. They make this appear a lot bigger and more castle-like online. Had I known how small this was, I probably wouldn't have booked it. I thought we were staying in a castle. But we also booked everything really late, so we're lucky to get a hotel on the Highlands. And I mean, come on, it's gorgeous. This is me being grumpy. It looks much more impressive from over here. Is this the actual entrance? Or is this part of the restaurant? I don't even know at this point. But the walkway ends here, so we're not going to go that way. But I will take some photos of it. It's pretty. So in order to walk through to reception, to the restaurant. Okay, set up. Not so weird that way. And this has some history about the hotel. Um, 1976. Oh, 
we would not pay that price. I wish we had. Not for my kids up there. Coaches are always waiting at the pier. Oh, this was in the middle of nowhere. The dining room looks the same. But, once you step into the old house, it's totally different. because Wonderwall. It's the registrar of revivals from the 60s. Oh my god. That's so That fireplace is on. That was the library. That was dog portraits. There's a gentleman's room through there. This is the lovely sitting room. This is gorgeous. Lots of games. Sitting area. And then you can see the lock and George Washington for some reason. Oh. Now this is relaxing. <laughs> 